Happy Halloween, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed that. We're not going to see that again. That is basically my favorite Super Nintendo of all time. Uh, favorite Super Nintendo game of all time. And definitely my favorite horror game of all time. Even though it's nothing compared to today's standards. This game rocks. So let's start. Let's go with Bowler, shall we? How are you guys doing? Are you guys doing anything special for tonight? Um, I plan on doing this as a premiere during my lunchtime tomorrow. I'm really addicted to that. I'm actually going to do a Rocket League stream right after this. So. Oh shit, I think I pressed the button. So, I don't know if you guys are familiar with my obsessive obsession and skills, I guess we could say, for Ninja Gaiden. Well, if I had a game that I'm as good on the Super Nintendo is probably this one here. I've played it numerous times. I've beaten in one man, um, which means I, I've been with a dime, but we're talking a long time ago. To try to do that again would be really hard today. And by the way, this music piece right here is definitely my favorite video game tune of all time. I'm just gonna shut up so you guys, you guys can listen. a cool tune. We're gonna progress now though. 
I don't know if you noticed, but it has the same sort of energy bar as Ninja Gaiden. Um, you have a sub weapon just like in like Ninja Gaiden, and you use hearts or you use a currency. Um, and this game is hearts that this dictates how many um, items you have left. Special weapon you have left. We're not gonna get the axe because it sucks. Got my double shot right here. Now I can use two of my weapons at the same time. That was a stupid mistake. Oh, I'm not doing too hot here. Oh, there was meat there, but I screwed up. Oh, good. Oh, good. Man. There's my triple shot. Got it right in time. So now I got three shots. Check this out. Oh my god. Which is nice. Alright. Now we're gonna keep it as long as we don't lose our special weapon. And... Am I gonna die? That'd be funny if I did. Actually, no. It would not be funny. I take that back. It would suck tremendously. So we're finally playing something else than Rocket League. And you know what? I'll try to make videos of different games. Um, I'll try to make some variety. Maybe, maybe Rocket League could be like every I don't know second day for a video. Cause I stream it enough. I love streaming Rocket League more than just playing a random game. But you know what? I plan on expanding my channel with different content. Got some meat now. We have full energy in case you guys have not noticed. You can do all kinds of cool stuff in this game. Um, you could swing your whip. You can even do that. It has like a wind effect. Cool. You can do like the moonwalk from Michael Jackson right here. Um, it's kind of hard to do, but. Um, how long I'm gonna play this game. Maybe the first three or four levels sounds fair, and then if you guys want to see more, I can stream the rest. That'd, that'd be kind of cool, eh? I could create like a save state. I don't think I'm gonna stream tonight. I mean, I'm passing Halloween with my kid. If it's not pouring rain, that is. And by the way, Bowler, I really hope you're keeping your dry fast, because you're doing a dry fast tomorrow. So no water or food, got it? Wow, savage. Alright. There's something in the wall here. So yeah, cool game. Hot hold. Cool game. Oh, that was cheeky. That was pretty savage, actually. This part here, you could actually die pretty easily. So, um, I'll give you an example. Yeah, <laughs> you guys see the horses in the background? It's so cool, eh? Like, look at all the backgrounds moving. It's, it's quite re remarkable. You're gonna see a better display of that in the next stage. This game was definitely ahead of its time. I definitely don't want to, the knife, so I'm gonna wait till it dissipates. Disappears, dissipates, no. That's not even worth it. Alright, we're approaching the first boss. And the end of the first stage. So. So this guy is pretty rough. Let's see if we can kill him. I think I hit there. I'm kind of disappointed in that. Now let's see if we can get a cool stance. That's not a cool stance. That was stage one of Super Castlevania 4 for your Super Nintendo.
I am playing this on the European Super Nintendo, which is basically the the one with the colored buttons. Like the green is uh, green is white button, yellow is B button, purple no blue is X, and red is A. Um, and the, also the big difference is there's no concave concave concave. I can't even say that right on the Super Nintendo. I don't know if you noticed, but there's uh, two different kinds of buttons. You don't have that with the Super Famicom version. Or the European version, sorry. But it's also mimicking the Japanese version, the Super Famicom. Don't want that. Yeah, look at all the backgrounds here. Oh, this guy's cool. Life guy. God, this game's good. Okay. Man. Even to me, this game looks good today, honestly. This game came out, I remember renting this game, all right? Check this out. That's how much of a nerd I was back in the day. Still a nerd, but I rented this game and I liked it so much. And I kind of wish I had it again, but I made a videotape. Back in the day, there was no DVDs, right? It was only VCR, so I rented the game and I recorded it because I liked it so much and I rewatched my tape over and over until I got it for Christmas. Crazy, I know. That's how much this game, um, how much I like this game. That is something that I don't want, right? No, it's not. It's a hard one. Check the music here, super awesome. <coughs> There's an enemy here that's pretty cool, if I could. These guys here. The sound they make when you kill them, check it out. Not this guy. Right here. Love it. Look at all the backgrounds here, like, look, check the background. That's pretty impressive. I'm a little fanboy of this game. I'm really curious to see how many people are going to be here tomorrow checking this out. Um, I know some people are kind of tired of Rocket League. So we might see some new faces in the chat tomorrow. So in, ca in case Bowler's being antisocial, I'm gonna say hi to you guys. How are you, how are you guys doing? Don't want that. That doesn't kill you, thankfully. See that frog? Oh, I never saw you, dude. Love the sound effects, by the way. Should be a frog coming up, coming up. Got some meat here. Right here on the wall. Meat, obviously, is the, um... It's energy, basically. Fills up your energy meter. Kill that bird. That bird's a little tricky. Check the deal... Check the details out here. No, wait. Oh, here, check this out when you jump. See that? That is so cool. See the uh, the, the rope or whatever you want to call it? The railing? The, I don't know what you call that. Bowler, you're going to learn some English, buddy. So, I know the volume is going to probably be loud, but we're, we're going to see. This is a test. This is a test. What am I? My audio is at minus 25 right now. Future Bowler. This guy is kind of hard, and Medusa head. Let's see if we could kill him. All right, cool. We got him. So interesting note here. Usually bosses are at the end of the level, but on this level, it's at the end of T2, and obviously, as you can see by the uh, by the stage number in the upper right corner, we're on stage two, three. So this is the continuation of the stage, and there's not going to be an, a boss on this on the stage. But there's also a boss at 4-1 and 4-4, which is kind of strange. Um, definitely by far my favorite Castlevania game. I'm, I'm just going to wait for the water to change direction. Elsewise, it would be kind of hell. Either way. So the stage is done, just like that. No, it's not. What are you talking about? The stage is not done. Not just like that. Whew. 
All right, I hesitated. I thought the stage was too short. And there's a part that's coming up that's kind of tricky, so. I definitely do not want to get another item. I want to keep the uh, triple boomerang as long as possible. I got six lives, by the way. And good, good in life department. Yeah, other Castlevanias, you cannot control your jump in the air. This one here, obviously, you can. And you can whip in all eight directions, so it makes this Castlevania definitely easier than some of the other ones. There was only two Castlevania games released on the Super Nintendo. There was this one released in 1991 called Super Castlevania 4, and there was another one in 1994, or 1995, I cannot remember, called Draculax, which is the inferior version of the, uh, super, uh, the Castlevania games on the Super NES. Um... It's basically a port of the awesome game called Rondo of Blood that's on the TurboGrafx-16, which I actually have on the Wii. If you guys want to see that, I could definitely play that in the future as well. Awesome music here, with definitely a, tr a change of pace. Definitely more mellow. Um, of course, this game being on the Super NES suffers from slowdown. That was definitely the flaw of the Super NES. Let's not get in the debate of the Super Nintendo versus Genesis. Because I'm a Nintendo fanboy, so it's not even going to be a race to me, or a fight. I mean, if you don't like this game, I don't know where you're from. If you played this game back in the day, I mean, just the music and everything. And check out the hard part right here. Right here, hit it. It's super cool. That is something I don't want, right? Oh god. I should take care of that guy. Okay, we well fucked up. Oh, not really. So there's a secret room here. Gee, that was hard to find, eh? There's three secret rooms in this game. This one here being the easiest to find. Don't want, oh yeah, I do want that actually. So we're definitely just going through the game with ease here, but the, it definitely picks up at, I would say starting at 3-3, the game picks up. There's some stuff in there that I don't care about, so I'm not gonna go there. You can kill these guys pretty easily with the boomerang. The cross, I call it the boomerang for some reason. Here you gotta be careful, right here, there's some stuff that's gonna fall from the floor, from the ground, from the... Yes, stuff is gonna fall from the ground. Fuck, Bull, you're, you're so smart. From the ceiling, maybe? So I, I just pretend... I just wanted to get hit there, I guess. Might as well use my boomerangs. We have 88. Okay, this stage here is one of the most blind stages in the game. Mostly because of the music. So, there's only like... This is the whole music of the, the stage. With some slight variance. Not a fan of this stage. So I just want to go through it as quickly as possible. Since I'm doing a friggin' dry fast, I can't even speak. I mean, I can't even drink water. I can't even speak. Um, and the water here looks good. I could drink it virtually, right? What a pun. Um, and I'm going to be streaming for a few hours after this Rocket League. <laughs> but this is in the future, so... Um, yeah, hopefully there was a good stream yesterday. And I wonder how I did. <laughs> It'd be cool if some people in the chat could reflect on that. Definitely looking forward to recording some more Rocket League videos with you guys as well. And we gotta bring back the, um... This part's a little tricky. We gotta bring back the uh, NES Online players as well. Need to play some more dodgeball with you guys. And ice hockey and whatever else. I got 99 hearts, that's crazy. No, the thing is, if you fall here, you die. 
Like, you just don't fall, you know what I mean? Like, in some games, if you fall, you'll just fall until you land on something. But old, older games, if you fall, you die. That's it. You can't kill those guys, by the way. I'm not going to get that item. I don't really care about it. And that's the end of the stage. Okay, this is where the game picks up. And features one of the best tunes of the game. Very jazzy. Definitely one of the only jazz tunes that I know on the, on the uh, Super NES. But I'm going to focus here a bit more. You gotta be careful, you just gotta wait for those guys to fall. One more and we're good. It's kind of sad how I know this game by heart. Oh, my God, savage. Dead. Um, I definitely recommend you guys to check check this game out. I thought it'd be perfect to play on Halloween. <laughs> Love it. I'm gonna wait for that guy to disappear. By the way, you can't kill those guys. Those the, the whatever you want to call that thing. Oh, okay. Here, I gotta watch it. Yeah, this part I could have easily died there. If you're not careful, you gotta watch for the plan here. I'm... I don't remember everything coming up here, so it might... Improvise. Oh shit, that's right, this part here. Very tough. You have to wait for him to... Shit. This... By the way, this song is so long. So this is kind of like a jazz solo right here, super cool. I know most of you don't really care for jazz or probably don't even... And I don't mean this in a bad way, but I don't think most people care for video game music at all. I just love music so much that it's like part of my life. Um... We're doing good. We're doing good. I think we passed the hardest part. We are actually getting... Oh no, we didn't. There's a part here that's coming up that's kind of tough. Oh, this part... Oh shit, I knew it. Lack of concentration. Lack of concentration. So we're starting from the second part here. And we died. That was our first, first death. It's funny, man. Sometimes you could almost predict your death in video games, right? You're like, you know what? You're not playing... You're playing sloppy, you're gonna die. And that really sucks. So we've lost our triple boomerang, which is definitely something you're not happy about. All right. Oh my goodness. I was not paying attention there at all. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. All of a sudden, Bowler's not confident anymore. Bowler has been. What's the word I'm looking for? Chip in my armor. No, that even makes sense. Let me kill this guy. Come here, jerk. That was worth it. Got a bunch of hearts. We only have the axe, though. But I think we should be okay for the boss. It would definitely be. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, you. S oh, my goodness. I did not. You. Fucking birds, man. Again, like Ninja Guy and the birds. Bird is the word. Got some mean, it's perfect. KFC? Or Popeyes, I think. You're, you guys have some Popeyes that sell chicken? Apparently we have some here too, but I've never tasted it. Say greasy food is good for you. Alright. Oh, shite. Well... I'm going to be spamming axes here, so we'll see what happens. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm not used to having this weapon. Wow. I think we're good. I think we're good. 
Oh wow, okay. Got scared there. Oh, look at that pose, baby. Look at that pose. Well, looks like we're at the end of stage three and we've been recording for about 25 minutes. Give or take, so. Maybe we could aim to do stage four and then we could call it a day. Or we could call it a video, actually. Castlevania 4, stage 4. I like it. Oh man, yeah, 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 the music, oh yeah. Okay. Oh shit, yeah, this is where the game says, you know what? No more fucking round. It's a long game, by the way. There's like over, what, 11 stages, I think, I want to say? Something like that. It gets pretty hard at the end of the game. Look how the eyes look at you here. Super cool, see that? Very cool. So check this out, check this out. Hold on. You're looking at me, I see you. All right. Let's hit. You know you're addicted to Rocket League when you're thinking about playing Rocket League right now. It's kind of savage, isn't it? But I am enjoying this game though. Hopefully you guys are too. Damn, I'm not, you know. Wow, one more hit and I'm dead. Okay, wow. And this part here is a bitch. I'm not gonna get that. I'm gonna have to be super careful now. Meat would be nice. Of course, if you jump on the green things, you die, right? I need it. Not that you die, but if you lie on them. Shit. I'm being extremely cautious right now. Is that meat? I need that. No! Talk about, again, predicting your death. We have two deaths. It's not good. It's not good, boy. I'm playing like a... Okay, I'm playing like a bronze one right now. Holy shit. All right, you know what? I'm gonna fucking around. Oh, fuck. Oh, cool, man. Okay. What a rookie mistake I just did right there. I like how that guy, that skeleton, looks like fucking Jackie Chan when you come close to him. He's like, Whoa! Dude, what was that? Don't quit your day job. Actually, you're working right now. Yeah, don't quit it. I don't need the meat, so I'm not even gonna go for that. And we're getting close to the... You know how I told you there was a boss at 4-1 and 4-4? Well, 4-1 and 4-4? Well, we're getting close to the boss at 4-1. And he's not, this guy's no picnic, he's no slouch, this guy. And again, I don't have my weapon of choice. I think we should be okay. Fuck, we just made it. We just made it. Do I get a refill of energy? No, I don't. Oh, this stage here. Hey man, what's up bro? You play too much Rocket League or shit? Yeah, this is awesome. Woo! So, can someone in the chat... Can someone in the chat and tell me what's the name of the effect that was happening right there? Back on the Super Nintendo days, the Super Nintendo could do something that, that the Genesis couldn't. And we saw a display of it right there. It, it actually, there's a few... There's, um... It's a specific 
name that I'm looking for. But like right now, this is an effect called rotation. There's also scaling, which is where an enemy or a background becomes smaller or bigger. There's the mul uh, as well. Those are just it's it's the name of a of um of something that I don't want to say. I just want to see if someone knows. I'm curious. And if you guys are watching this in the few as a video, well, you could point it out. Also. So we survived stage 4 too. Check out the background on this stage here, and expect a lot of slowdowns here. Now, I'm sorry, but this is still trippy to this day. And this is friggin' what? 27 years old? Wow. We still did not get any meat, though. Hey, I love this game. It's answering my prayers. So this is 4-3, we're getting close to 4-4. Four, 4-1 four. Four, and 4-2 are, they're a joke, really. 4-4 four, four is really hard. Well, not, not really hard. It gets harder for sure. Alright. So here you could die if you like. Obviously, if I just continue here, I die, right? I'd get smashed. Don't hesitate, dude. Am I supposed to go here? I don't know if I was supposed to go there. Oh, I died! I never knew that was there! I'm, I'm experimenting, I don't usually take that route, I'll be totally honest with you guys. I'll show you guys the route I take now. We should not die anymore. Man. That is pretty savage to put that there. Wow. I was pushing my left there for sure. Dude, I'm just letting, letting that guy kill me. It's gonna be a challenge, I'm not gonna lie. This is a one-hit kill right here. Here, you just gotta freaking scoot. Use a boost if you have to. For the sake of this video, I'm going to create a save state right here. Because I do not want to do this part over and over. It's a, it's a boss, right? So, I'm definitely going to do this. Alright, we're good. Just in case. I shouldn't die, but you never know. I might die, actually. This boss is tough. Again, mode 7 effects. Oh shit, I said- I, I revealed the, the thing I wanted to say earlier. Mode 7, that's what I was looking for as an answer. You know, if you play good defensively here, you should be okay. We're not even taking one hit so far. Wow. Wow, no hits, man. Flawless victory, baby. Again, mode 7 effects, totally cool, rotation and scaling at the same time. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this fucking joystick falls on the fucking floor, that's great, bitch. Um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed Super Castlevania for on the Super Nintendo. I really hope you guys have a safe and awesome Halloween. And yeah, it's been Bowler, and uh, we'll see you in the next video. Make sure you hit me with a like and a sub. And I'm a, mostly a streamer, so yeah. So we're just going to end with this eerie music. Think about this when Satan comes and rips their heart off tonight.